from the 1st of February, my people. What did you say, Rico? There's a tree No, 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 what did here. you say? What did you say? I thought you were going to say this is my birthday month and then you're going to go on and on about it. And on, you said and on and on and, and, on, and, on, and on and on. That was the tree Rico was pointing at. The, can you see it? Yeah. I think I've already showed you that. I am absolutely freezing because I have just come out of a yoga studio which was roasting. And before that I did, um, what did I do? LBT. And uh, yeah. So right now... <laughs> Looking like this, we are out walking. People, it's too cold for me to care how I look. Rico's like that. Well, what you got on your head? Tea cozy. <laughs> no, that was down. That was the fence I was telling you was down. So they've obviously put it up and stuck that plank of wood there to hold it up. To support it till it all set. There's that bin lorry people. <laughs> You're supposed to sit Lily at the roadside. Sit, sit, okay. <laughs> it's not good having Rico around when I vlog. It just takes the uh, pee pee out of me all the time. Right. This is the top that I showed in last night's vlog. I don't know if this vlog's going to go up today, but in what day was it yesterday? Wednesday's vlog. Okay, so I showed two items from Zara. So this is what it looks like with the shirt. I just, I, I just wouldn't wear it without like this shot. I just wouldn't do that. Okay, so that's what it looks like. And I'll tell you what it reminds me of, like body armor. I feel as if I've put some body armour on, you know those jackets, bulletproof jackets? I feel that's the vibe it's giving, it's not me. So, lovely top, shame it's not longer, I would have kept it if it was longer. So, it's going back. There we go, I just thought I would show you what it looks like over a shirt. Hi my people, right. Where did I leave you last night? I was trying on the top, wasn't I? So, I've had my nails done, which, can I tell you, are they going to pick up? I'm absolutely obsessed with. So I can't remember if I said, but I was going to get the chrome. Oh, there, they're there. Oh, I love them. So I've got that kind of chrome powder over the French. So that's the modern French. That's modern French with chrome. Love them. Yeah, and if you're going to have fake nails, you might as well make them look fake. <laughs> so, after my nails, we went and we bought a jacket for Rico because he was needing like an everyday jacket out of TK Maxx, which he's now put away, but it's really lovely. Um, I'm sure you'll see him wearing it at some point, walking Lily. I picked up two quilt covers. One, not covers, quilts, actual quilts for Cyprus. There we go. And apparently we were advised by, advised by Cypriots to get, take them from over here because they are extortionate in Cyprus. I got two 10.5 uh, tog in the king size and I decided to go for the 10.5 so because this is bulky enough to put in the cases. So that's one for Costa and Kerry and one for Theo and Anna because when we're going to Cyprus, we're all going together. So we're going to do a wee break. No, it's not our summer break, it's a pre-summer break. So that's that. What I actually went for was a basket. So I got the same one and that was out of... Where did I get that? Out of home... No, it wasn't. It wasn't Home Bargains. It was B&M. Basket was out of B&M. And you know, you don't just go in for a basket, do you? So, I got some 7-Ups to have in the house. They're for kind of Georgie's treat. And sometimes Rico will take them as well. I got some Square Crisps, because everybody loves Square Crisps. Obviously, I don't eat them. Rico hardly eats crisps these days as well. can't believe Rico. I mean, he's eating habits have changed so much since his diagnosis of high blood pressure it used to be I mean he used to be oh, 
everything in moderation but it really has cut down on all of that stuff as well I picked up some dry shampoo which <laughs> yeah, tomorrow I'm gonna get my color that I cannot wait so I needed some dry shampoo this is the dry shampoo lifted I've never seen this one before but the scent is jasmine and that's a scent I don't like so hopefully does it look white that's all right yeah it's not a it's not a scent I like I'm going like that because I've got that on <laughs> so carry on I'm so used to wearing jewelry and not worrying about it it's all right actually it's not bad it's nice it's okay. Oh, I keep bringing I've put everything in the basket. I got a micellar cleansing rose water again. Removes makeup, cleanses, glow. I do like triple cleansing. So I'll go in with my balm and I think it's the Elemis I'm using just now. The Elemis balm which Kelly gave me. And then I go in with that and then I go in with a wash. Honestly, paranoid. Showed you that and whilst I was there I saw this I've never seen this before I don't even know what the what the make is but I just got it anyway so it's a balm again and it's me make, makeup removing cleansing balm uh, melts away and it's green tea that's what oh, hide my face there that's what that looks like so that'll probably not last me long because I use quite a lot but anyway I'll finish off the Elemis it's good for the empties to have different things isn't it so that's good because i've got my quilts that's i can tick them off the list i need to actually start making up a list of things that i'll need for cyprus because before we know it, it'll be time to go to cyprus so february this month we're going to where are we going people house i can't remember what it's called now oh my goodness me it's gone right out my head oh, hold on okay wait a minute it's going to be in my diary it will be it will be in the agenda people let's see in the agenda we are going god it's february isn't it we are going to cameron house <laughs> we're going to cameron house february we're going to nico's in march and april we go to cyprus busy 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 looking forward to good fun for Costa and Kelly to experience Cyprus not in the summer so you'd be doing more going into the mountains or that you've you've all seen it before because you followed me in Cyprus so um we're going to be there a week before them and kind of do catch up on business that we need to do whilst we're there so we can spend the week they come over with them that's the plan that is the plan my people feeling the nails oh I love the nails <laughs> right let's so i just kept the shirt on that i had on from earlier on it's just a shirt from prima i do like a white shirt i do i do like a white shirt that's why i've got a few of them i do like shirts and i do like blouses but you know that right so i'm gonna go and have my roast dinner we're gonna have roast chicken and rico's made roast potatoes i'll probably not have potatoes and cabbage I might have a wee glass of wine because I've got my nails done and I feel as if I'm going out. <laughs> kind of always feel like that when I get my nails done. I'm going to put this away and go and eat my dinner and stop rambling on. Hello my darlings, let's close the door. Welcome to the 2nd of February. I've had my roots done. Just, it's very dark now because I'm really needing highlights. But I want to leave my highlights until my birthday to get the full shh, everything done. So I just got the roots touched up so the greys would disappear. So that's what I've been up to today. Actually, I've been up to a lot. So <laughs> on a Friday, I normally do two classes, but today I did three one too many people because it exhausted me so I did a third one because I normally do spin on a Saturday but I decided to do my spin today instead of tomorrow because I don't want to get sweaty tomorrow 
okay because I got my hair done today and I thought what's the point of getting my hair done and then getting really really sweaty I am going to do a class tomorrow I'm going to do LBT but that doesn't get me all sweaty like a spin class so and I didn't actually know how I was going to be in the spin class so tomorrow's spin class is 45 minutes and today it was only half an hour but it was a hard half hour we had cover so it was an instructor that I know who's also a friend of mine who I knew from David Lloyd so she was covering the class so she won't let me away from with anything she in fact takes my first class on a friday morning which is metafit so I did metafit then i came home i did what i had to do in the house i went back and i did circuits not much time and i went back like there's not even enough time to walk lily within that time so i kept, so i went back i did circuits and then there's about 15 minutes between circuits and the spin class so uh, another girl from the gym and I just went onto the treadmill, chatted and walked on the tr treadmill on an incline. We burnt 200 calories anyway, so it was worth doing that. Rather than just standing about chatting and waiting about, we decided to wait about on a treadmill, burning 200 calories. So then I did the spoon class, rushed home. So my hairdressing appointment was at two o'clock and I got out the class at one o'clock and I had to shower. So I rushed, literally rushed home on a fast by the way all this time on a fast so rushed home literally jumped into the shower got some makeup on this makeup this is what's left of what i put on just some quick makeup then rico drove me down to save me time so i wouldn't have to think about parking and all of that so he took me down and then i did a fail after the hairdressers i phoned rico i says that's me ready how far away because i texted him i says that's me finishing up and then when i got out the hairdressers i says how far away are you and then i was like oh i've got time to go into pre-mark oh no nah. went into pre-mark but i picked up this serum so i noticed they had a range of all these serums like a really good range it's like it's almost like a copy of the serum that you we used to be able to get in in boots what's it called and it wasn't very expensive and they did like real like the different parts that which really and I, I couldn't get into it because for me it's really confusing because i don't know what to use when what to layer with what and all of that so it looks like premark are doing that as well i can't remember what the name of it is but anyway it looks like premark are doing it anyway i've decided to pick up i looked at them all quickly because i didn't have very much time because rico was going to pick up was coming to pick me up didn't buy clothes so i was good but I'm, i was needing a serum because at the moment i'm using my night Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair and I'm using that both in the morning and at night so I thought something different because you know how I like to add different things because you get different benefits but I need to really be careful because we all know how sensitive my skin is anyway this is Nias <laughs> Niacinamide okay Booster Serum so it was the word serum so I'm going to use that um, under my after I've toned and all that in the morning under my moisturizer so this then my moisturizer is what i'm going to use so it's 10 percent nice cinnamide zinc and hyaluronic acid all sounded very good to me all sounded like things that are supposed to be good for your skincare so i'm going to give it a try it's like looks like that it felt when i tried it in the shop it felt was it oily jelly let me see that it's there quite yeah it feels lovely actually i'll tell you see that hand's gonna look amazing and that one's gonna be really wrinkly because everything i test is on that hand and that finger's gonna be beautiful too because <laughs> that's how we apply everything anyway four pounds can't go wrong i'll let you know if i you know i'm gonna let you know if i get a reaction to it so that's what i've been up to today this is my uniform that i wear to the hairdressers i also always take my long shop which i have now emptied and put away because i am an organized person <laughs>
and I just put everything back into my Neverfull right there, my beautiful Neverfull, which I still haven't reviewed, which I still need to review. And I took a magazine with me. This was a magazine. How many years has it been? We don't, just don't buy magazines anymore. This used to be a weekly thing for me. So I picked this up when I was going to Milton Keynes. But by the way, I am a type of person, you ca I cannot read in the car and I cannot be on my phone for too long in the car either because I get sick. But I fancied this. Oh, what is it? Sorry. No, what is it? No, just anyway, I was saying the magazine. So I, I mean, I, we, we were doing a stop in one of the stops as we were going to Milton Keynes. And as I came out, I said, when you're a shopaholic, people, you're a shopaholic. You need to buy something. I saw this magazine. I thought, oh, I fancy the articles in there. Let me. And I enjoyed it, actually. Do you remember when we used to go to the hairdressers? There used to be piles of magazines. Now everybody's sitting there like this <laughs> on their phones taking pictures of their hair and all that we've all done it people we've all done it so yeah I enjoyed actually having a wee read on my magazine I did have a look at my phone of course I did anyway so that's what I have been up to today so I was saying I was I did all that all those classes on a fast so today I did about a 20 about 21 hours and 30 minute fast only because I didn't have time to eat but so I came home, I had apple cider vinegar, which is how I would start my breaking my fast. Apple cider vinegar. Enrico had made macaroni to forno pasticcio, which is a layer of macaroni, uh, mince and bechamel sauce. It's amazing and it's something that I avoid because it is full of a lot of things that I shouldn't be eating. <laughs> <laughs> but it is absolutely delicious it is our traditional greek dish which i absolutely love and i thought do you know what i've not had anything to eat i'm gonna enjoy it did i have one wee portion no i had two great big portions like about that size and then i finished it off with a date thing because that's what you do also last night i was saying i was gonna have a glass of wine i didn't have that glass of wine last night but i did have it tonight people only one only one i may have another i don't know anyway the plan was i have sat here i have done all my homework like loads and loads of it loads and loads of it for my vca bracelet but i got right into uh, discovering how mother of pearl is formed oh it was I just I love learning things like that you know we all love to learn about things that interest us and I found it so interesting how mother of pearl is formed and made and all of that and because I was like is it as delicate I wanted to find out if it is actually as delicate as everybody says and I couldn't in my head work out why we couldn't get mother of pearl wet when actually it is formed in water in a shell isn't it and i couldn't I, I just couldn't understand it but anyway i'm going to share everything that i've learned so this is a problem with me I'm, i take all this information in and i love all this information but see when it comes to relating it back to you i am useless i'm going to try my best i always do but yeah it's really really interesting you probably all know all of it anyway but i found it really interesting so for me instead of just talking about the VC, I want to talk about the mother of Pearl as well, which is, I think maybe a lot of people are put off by it because of how delicate it can be. But I'm going to talk about why VCA and, you know, advise us not to get it wet and all of that. But, so I've done all my homework on it and I would actually be best filming that just now but it's all fresh in my mind but I also know that I am quite exhausted from overdoing it at the gym and just rushing today because I really haven't stopped and, I, and I've, I literally had my dinner came upstairs I have actually been reading up on it now for a few days but I just kind of put all the information like I organized the information basically also about water i'm not taking as much water now because it was obvious my body couldn't cope with the extra amounts of water so i've literally gone back to taking water when my body asks it i've always maintained listen to your body and i think 
the same applies to water because when I, I, I told you in the other vlogs I kept paying people it was a ridiculous amount that I was paying so obviously my body wasn't needing it because it was getting rid of it right now I'm feeling thirsty because probably Rico's used too much salt and then in the pasticcio there's halloumi and all of that as well so if all of that adds to it so my body's saying Andrew give me water so I'm giving my my body water that's another cup from Jules <laughs> Uh, um so that's what i've been up to this friday if i shared everything right why i turned on the camera because i got i don't know if i'm supposed to use her name i don't think there would be anything wrong with using her name right i'm not going to use her name just in case but anyway a friend of mine if she wants you all to know who she is she'll sit down in the comments so a friend of mine on instagram and here on youtube shared with me today that she ordered something from hermes and i was so surprised that this thing existed from hermes so you know the air tags that we get for our luggage or keys or things like that well she said she wanted one for her Hermes garden party so she has two she has a leather one and a canvas one and she was saying to me that her leather one has an inner pocket but the canvas one doesn't that's interesting as well very interesting but she wanted to keep an air tag you know the apple air tag in her bag but in her canvas bag but because it didn't have an inner pocket she decided to order uh the ones from hermes the air tags from hermes the apple because we know they collaborate don't they hermes and apple because they do the apple watch and all of that so you get an air tag and it's like a bag charm i'm going to insert photographs of all of this i've got her packaging that it came in she sent me pictures of the packaging because we were talking about packaging how it was all packaged and her air tag is all packaged in the orange box it was absolutely beautiful but what an amazing idea and i thought with the air tag looking like a bag charm because somebody steals your bag okay they're gonna empty they're gonna get rid of all the contents aren't they? they're gonna get rid of keep whatever i'm listening if they get rid of the contents all our wee expensive pouches and all that people and are worth a fortune but anyway all that aside so you know they're gonna see that it's an air tag get rid of it blah blah but if it's a bag charm nobody's gonna know you you're not gonna notice it as quickly you're just gonna assume it's a bag charm what a great idea I, honestly is it just me that is excited by this i am so excited by that like you could put these little bag charms on your birkins people come on tell me this is not a good idea i mean i know i get excited by all these small things but do you not think that's amazing like an hermes bag charm air tag for your bag and how good does it look i think it, it's people people it looks better than those blinking horses everybody's hanging on their birkins which i've never so sorry if i'm if you have one and you know each to their own people each their own that's just my taste personally i wouldn't be spending however much they are i don't even know how much they are but i'm guessing they're in the high hundreds and thousands maybe even depending on some of them but i'd rather that air tag hanging from my bag that's going to do a job than a, a, a horse people but that's just me and that's just my opinion okay and you know we've all said things and then thought you know you know like hey what grown woman is gonna carry a little palm springs mini a little rack sack this one that said what a stupid idea that was here she is and then i'm the one that said oh what an ugly bag that is to me now i think that's one of the most beautiful bags reminds me of my school satchel when i was at school i used to have a brown satchel and then remember when everybody was buying those satchel ones that you know they almost became like designer satchels that one i didn't get 
like literally didn't get it mentally and didn't get it because I was like, no, no I ain't carrying that. I did that already when I was at school. <laughs> Where have we gone? Where have we gone? See, I'm now, I'm now in the mood. I've started chatting. I'm in the mood to do my... I might do it, people. I might do it. Anyway, I also got a call there that my son's boiler is broken. I did say to him, and my youngest son says to him, you can come and stay here the night. Son, no, 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 it's, it's, ah, oh, I just got a lovely message from the girl I was seeing. We were on chatting on the treadmill. She says, thanks for your company today in the gym. It was nice getting to know you more. Oh, I need to reply back, people. Isn't that nice? That was nice. Anyway, message back. I thought that, isn't that, see people, be nice and just let people know. Like, don't, don't be scared of your feelings, because that just made me feel really, really nice. As a girl that we've kind of, I've chatted to before lots of times in gym, hi, the, 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 but today we just the two of us were on the treadmill just chatting and she just, oh. So, tell, I mean, I, I mean, you're all lovely, you all, you all give me lovely comments in, in the, in my comments, I'm, I'm blushing. It takes a lot to make me blush, people, but it just gets me, like, I don't know, it just, it just, just really gets me. That's actually a second message I've had like that today, I got one as, as well this morning, from somebody that I've known for a really long time, actually, and they just messaged me, just saying, just thank you for being you, another girl that I know, and I'm like, I must be giving good, I must be in a good place and be giving off good vibes at the moment. <laughs> I actually ran down and told Rico as well because it gets me. Gets me. <sighs> I don't know. I just must be just be giving off good vibes. <laughs> anyway, that's that. Shall we do the, shall we do the, shall we do the tag? Shall we do that? Not tag. Shall I do that video? I'm in a good mood now to do it. I'd have to go and redo my makeup because I like to make an extra special effort when I'm doing um, kind of sit down videos. I'm sitting down now, but this is like us. <laughs> um, I don't know. Anyway, I'm going to leave the vlog, this vlog here just now. <laughs> this vlog full of Actually, I was going to say useless information, but that information about the Hermes air tag I thought was brilliant. So thank you very much. <laughs> thank you very much for for that. Cause I, 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 you know me. I love to hear something new. That was very new to me. I didn't know that. So thank you. So if you want an air tag, I wonder how I wonder how much they are. I have no idea but then I mean as it goes air tags are not cheap anyway the actual Apple ones anyway enough thank you very much for being here with me if you would like to see more videos I shall link one here and one here and if you're not subscribed which I'm sure you are if you've watched this vlog there's an A right here and I'll see you on the next one <laughs>